Hi, I'm Chef Robert Bruce at Desi Vegas Seafood in Metairie. And we're open today and it's Mardi Gras day, believe it or not. Today we're gonna to make trout a la maniere. And then we're gonna turn the trout a la maniere into trout amandine. A la maniere means uh, like the Miller's wife. Amandine means with lots of love or something like that. I'll get back to that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start out with a hot saute pan. And we're gonna take a piece of trout. This trout came from North Carolina. We're gonna season it with some salt and pepper on both sides. And then we're gonna dredge it in some flour. We want a nice coating of flour on there. That gives it its crust. All right, shake it off a little bit and put, do it again. Okay, dry our hands off. And then in our saute pan, we're gonna take about a teaspoon of butter we turn it down a little bit, it's a little bit too hot, right? So if it's too hot, just pull the pan off, let it cool off for a second. All right. There we go. So we swirl our butter, then we take our fish, and we put it in. This is the, the bone side of the fish. This is the skin side of the fish. Bone side is the presentation side. So we only want to cook the fish we only want to flip the fish once. So we only cook it on one side and then flip it over and cook it on the other side. So the fish is going to absorb some of the butter. So we're going to add a little bit more butter to it. All right. There we go. Then we're going to swirl that around a little bit until we get a nice golden crust. So what's happening here is the flour is coming off in the butter and we're sort of making a roux, which is gonna help thicken the sauce. We have our trusty fish spatula. We're gonna turn it up just a little bit. Excuse me for one moment. I need to check my notes. Speckled trout is from uh, Beaufort, North Carolina. We're gonna add some crab meat to that too. Crab meats are from Vermilion, the crabs are from Vermilion Bay, New Iberia. I'd like to thank my friend Robbie Hare, who owns JB Foods, for the crab meat today. So we have a nice little, we get a nice little brown crust. And what I'm looking for is on the edges right here. See where it's turning brown right along there? That's what we're looking for. Nice golden brown crust. It takes about three minutes on each side. So I'm gonna flip it now. When I flip it, I wanna get my fish spatula. I wanna turn the butter that way and then flip it away from me. There we go. Nice golden brown. Okay, Just swirl it around a little bit. Hey, hit me another lemon wrap. Thank you. So I have these cool lemons, they're wrapped in a cheesecloth so I can squeeze it without getting seeds in it. We serve this with all our fish here. A lot of times people, they unwrap it and they take it out of the lemon wrap and then they squeeze their lemon, but, because they don't know. The knowledge is everything. So now what we're gonna do here is we're gonna add some of our ingredients to make it almondine. It cooks fast. We're gonna take some lemon juice. All right. Parsley, let it fry up a little bit in there. We're gonna throw some almonds on that. We're gonna hit it with a little bit more butter. This is some butter that I made, which is really easy to make. It's just heavy cream in a, in a mixer, and you mix it until it separates the buttermilk and the butter. We're gonna take, we're gonna, we're gonna move over here, and we're gonna plate it over here. Oh, let's add the crab meat too. Why not? That looks good, doesn't it? So the almonds are kind of toasted up a little bit. The parsley's frying. What you don't want to do is burn it. You got some crab meat? Ooh, yeah, baby. Good stuff. And we're going to take the fish out. Come over here. Set it up on our plate. Roll it around a little bit. And one more lemon wrap, bro.
Put a piece of lemon wrap on there. Garnish with some parsley. Sell it. That's it.